Hello and in this video I'll be showing how to set up a project in MPLAB X. First you go to File, New Project, select Standalone Project, click Next, select the device you'll be programming, in my case it will be a PIC 18F4520, select and click Next, select your programmer, in my case a Picket 3, Select your compiler, XC18, which we installed in a previous video. Now give your project a name. I will call this set up. Choose the directory you want your project to be located in. Mine was already set up. Click finish. Now we want to add a new source file. So right click source files and click uh, new C main. Remove the new and click finish. This will automatically generate a C file for you. And then we want to generate a new header file. Right click header files, new XC8 header file. And I will call this con bits and click finish. Now from the header file, remove all unneeded comments. Uh, until you're left with this. Change the default generated header name to con bits or capitals. Next we're going to set up the configuration bits, which you go to Window, Pick Memory View, um, Configuration Bits, extend this up. First one is our oscillator setting, I will be using the internal oscillator with port functions on RA6 and RA7. Then we go to the Brownout Reset Enable, we disable that in Software and Hardware, disable the Watchdog Timer, um, Capture and Compare can stay the same, Port B will be set as Digital I.O. on Reset, um, Clear Pin should be enabled, stack, uh, disable the Stack Under Overflow Reset, um, Next we're going to click Generate Source Code to Output, select all of this, copy it, and then paste it into our header file. Check that everything is right, remove this last include. And the next thing we're going to add is our oscillator frequency definition which I have already done here. Let's just copy that from here and paste. So it will be underscore xdal underscore freeq and then your oscillator's frequency in hertz. So in this case it will be 1 megahertz which is 1 million hertz. Then next we go to where the defaults are and then we customize that. We click on Picket 3, click on Memories to Program, and then we select Power. Now here you can select to power the device from, from either the target or if you're using ex uh, external power supply, this is not necessary. I will be using an external power supply. Click Apply, and click OK. Now we go back to our C main file and include quotation marks converts.h. And now we build to check. And that's a happy compiler. Thank you, and I hope this was helpful. Have a nice day.